Hi there and welcome to Earth and Owl. I'm Nikki and I want to say thank you so much for 5,000 subscribers on YouTube. Some of you may know that COVID forced the closure of my in-person business and I never dreamed that I would have a online business and a following online. So thank you, thank you, thank you. We're going to start today's workout with a couple of stretches. So I want you to start by taking your right foot and placing it on the center of your trampoline. This left foot is gonna turn so that your toes face forward and you have a heel to arch alignment, meaning your front heel intersects with the arch of your back foot. Standing up nice and tall, you're gonna slide forward until your right knee stacks over your right ankle, okay? If you want a little more intensity here, you can top, uh, hop this back foot a little further out. Bring your arms up to parallel turn and gaze over your right fingers and let's take a couple slow deep breaths here big inhale sigh it out once more perfect nice uh, inner thigh stretch here pull this back let's do the same thing on the other side left foot to the center of the trampoline these right toes are going to turn so we have heel to arch alignment slide the hips forward Knee stacking over ankle. Nice strong core, nice tall stance. We inhale, couple of deep breaths. All right, slide this back. Similar stretch, only we're gonna be working the front line of the body this time. Take that right foot back on the trampoline. This time we're doing a bit of a balancing act. So your back foot, you're balancing on the ball with your heel lifted. Nice, strong, firm core. Again, we're sliding the hips forward until our knee stacks over our ankle. So we've got right foot forward, left foot back. We're gonna take our left arm and inhale, reach it straight up. Couple deep breaths here. Okay, hands to waist, slide the hips back, and we do the other side, same thing. Left foot on, do a little hop here until you find a nice balanced stance, back heel lifted, strong core, slide forward, knee stacking over ankle. This time the right arm inhales up. release slide the hips back now these exercises are not only going to stretch your inner thighs hips groin area but they're also strengthening exercises as well let's get a little side body stretch in so feet about hip width distance apart here inhale bring your arms up grasp onto your right wrist with your left hand watch out what's happening here really firm up a little tuck of the pelvis and take it over Pressing down through the right foot a little bit. Come back to center, switch your grip over to the left hand. Take it over, stretching the left side body now. Good, coming back to center and release. Final little stretch here I like to do is just a simple, easy twist. Arms are loose at the sides and we're kind of swinging the arms nice and big. Twist, twist, twist. All right. So I am going to be attaching the balance and stability bar to my trampoline today, but I'm gonna show variations with and without the bar. So let's work out together. All right, I'm calling this workout Brain Boost today because we're gonna be stringing together five different moves and creating a bit of a routine, which is a great healthy exercise for your brain and your body. Uh, as a reminder, if you don't like the advertisements that play in my YouTube videos, head to earthandowl.com for the advertisement free variations. All right, let's start with a little health bounce here. Let's get those heels lifted. Start thinking a bit about your form. 
We've got just a bit of a soft knee, little hinge in the hips, athletic ready position, balls of the feet on the trampoline, heels being lifted. If you feel confident getting airborne, certainly pick your feet up. Really engaging through your core, drawing your navel back towards your spine and firming up all those abdominal muscles. Take a couple deep breaths. Let's do a few sweeping arm movements here. Right arm inhales up and down. Left side up and down. Right again or both. Inhale, exhale. Last time. All right, moving into our first move, we have a side to side. I'm gonna show you the modification first. Step, tap, tap, tap. This is your modification or side to side. Without the bar, we've got a little more of an arm swing going. We're controlling our movements. The side to side is really gonna get your heart rate up. Try to keep your inner thighs squeezing together slightly. Decide where you're at today. Are you step tapping? Are you using the bar? Maybe you're experimenting for the first time without. You can always have the bar in front of you just in case. This is our first move, side to side. Let's count this down. Let's do a couple of sets. Remember, a set is a count of eight. So we'll do two sets here. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, health bounce. Nice work. And that side to side really gets the heart rate up and gets things moving. All right, come back to your form, always checking in. The next move I call a ballerina. I don't know why, I guess it's just kind of reminds me of a ballerina dance. So you're gonna start with your feet wide on your trampoline. We're going to cross. So our right foot goes to the front and our uh, left foot goes to the back, kind of like at 12 o'clock and six o'clock. Jump wide, left comes over first. Left to the front at 12 o'clock, right at six o'clock. Wide, right, wide, left, wide, right, wide, left, okay? You can keep this pace right here or you can speed it up. Out, switch, switch, switch. If you're not using the bar, your arms do exactly what your legs do. Right arm forward, left arm forward. Right arm forward, left arm forward. Okay, a modification might be tap, 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 tap. All right, so decide where you're at today. Are you right here tapping alternate feet? Out, switch, out. Maybe you're taking the pace a little slower. Switch, out. Maybe you're going a little faster, out. Switch, switch, switch. Maybe you've got those arms going too. The thing I love about rebounding is you get to determine the intensity. I say that in just about every workout. This is all up to you. All right, let's count this down. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, health bounds. Nice work. Let's put our first two moves together. Remember, this is a brain workout, so we've got to go back and remember what was our first move? Side to side. We'll do two sets of side to side. You pick the variation, and two sets of ballerina. All right, think it through. What's your side to side variation? What's your ballerina variation? Let me count it off. In four, three, two, side to side. Here we go. 15, 14, 13. Inner thigh squeezing. Eight more. Eight, seven, six. Coming up, ballerina. In four, three, two, side to side. 
three, two, ballerina, take it wide, right, left, right, left, five, six, seven, eight, eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, down, bounce. All right, practice makes perfect. Let's try that again. 16 counts of side to side. 16 counts, ballerina. In four, three, two, side to side. Here we go. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Step it wide. Here we go. Out, switch, switch. Four, three, two, last eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, health bounce. Okay, nice work. Two moves down, three to go. Our next move is just a health bounce with the feet, okay? We're gonna keep it right here. What I want you to focus on is your core and your form because we're gonna add some big arm movements in here. So let's keep it simple with the legs. We're gonna add a right punch, a shoulder press, a left punch, a shoulder press, back to right. Right, press, left, press, pick it up, here we go. Right, press, left, press, right, press. Here's a little modification. You can do right, just a right press, left, just a left press, keeping one hand on the bar at all times. All right, there's your modification. Or right, press, left, press. Keep working on that core. Oops, I think I messed myself up. Right, press, trying to talk and move at the same time. Press, press, right, press, left, press, press. 16 more, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, health bounce. All right, back to the top, side to side, ballerina, punch presses, side to side, ballerina, punch presses. Two sets of eight, each move. Decide your variation. In four, three, two, side to side. Here we go. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Coming up, ballerina. In four, three, two, step it wide right here. Out, cross, cross, cross. Six, seven, eight more. Eight, seven, six. Punch press in four, three, two. Health bounce right here. Punch, press, punch, press. Five, six, seven, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Okay. Nice work, let's do that once again from the top. I'm gonna do the low impact variation of all three right here. Four, three, two, side to side, here we go. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, ballerina. Tap, tap, tap. Seven, eight more, eight, seven. Nice firm core here. Four, three, two, punch and press. Here we go. Punch, press, punch, press. Five, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Health bounce, okay. We're over halfway done with this workout. If you need a little break here, a little step tap, shake it out, couple of deep breaths. Our next move, I just call it the shake it. It's a little bit like a twist. 
You can have feet a little closer together, feet a little further apart, and you're shifting your hips from side to side. Now, to get arm movement involved, it looks like this. If you need to hang on, just do one arm at a time. Pick the arm that feels most comfortable for, for you. This is called the shake it, okay? Like so. So as we come off of those punch presses, we're gonna shake it, shake it out. Now you can, if you want more intensity, squeeze those inner thighs, really uh, activate and engage the legs, pick up the feet. Here's a high intensity version, okay? Low intensity version. Or here, hips shifting side to side. All right, pick your level. Let's do 16 counts in four, three, two, shake it. Here we go, 16, 15, 14, 13, 10, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Health bounce. All right, we've got four moves down. Let's go back to the top. What were they from the top? We've got side to side, ballerina, punch press, shake it. Make that brain work here, brain boost. All right, side to side in four, three, two counts of 16. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, ballerina, 16, 15, 14, 8, 7, 6, punch press coming up in four, three, two, punch and press right here, right, then press, left, then press, five, six, seven, eight more, Eight, seven, six, shake it coming up in four, three, two, shake it out. Here we go. Up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, health bounce. We've got one more move left. Now, if you're enjoying this type of workout, you're liking the routine and the choreography and putting it together. This is very much how my bounce two and bounce three workouts go. I walk you through it and then we kind of start putting it all together and speeding it up a bit, okay? Final move here, switches. So right foot forward, left foot back, switch, switch. Switch modification, step up, step back, step up, step back, like so. For more intensity, switch. Now, if you're not using the bar, you've got those arms pumping right along with the legs. The bigger your arms, the higher your heart rate. You can really pick it up if you want to. Keep drawing navel back to spine, so you're keeping those abdominals engaged. This is our last move of our five move routine brain boost. Let's count it up. 16, 15, 14, 13, eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, health bounce right here. Okay, we're ready. We've got the whole thing. Let's put all five moves together, side to side, ballerina, punch press, shake it out, switches. Are you ready? Do it with me. 16 counts each move. I'm gonna do it first time through low impact, second time through higher impact. All right, here we go. In four, three, two, side to side, right here. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, Seven, six, ballerina coming up in four, three, two, ballerina, tap, tap, tap.
tap. This is the low impact. Four, three, two, set. One more set. Eight, seven, six. Punch press coming up in four, three, two. Punch press right here. Punch, press left hand. Punch, press now right. Punch, press. Eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Shake it right here. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight more. Eight, seven, six switches coming up in four, three, two switches. Here we go. Step up, step back, step up, step back. Seven, strong core. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, health bounce. Okay, we're going again. This time I'm gonna do the highest impact variation that I know how. You do you. In four, three, two, side to side. Here we go. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. Big arms. Ballerina in four, three, two. Step wide right here. Hup, two, three, four. Press it down. Five, six, seven, eight more. Eight, seven, six. We got punch and press coming up in four, three, two. Right punch. Here we go. Right, then press. Left, then press. Five, six, seven, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Shake it right here. 16, 15, 14, 13. Eight more. Eight, seven, six. Coming up to switches in four, three, two. Right, left. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hell's bounce. Whoo! That was a nice, intense workout. Hell's bounce. Catch your breath. Nice job. Let's slow it down a little bit. Side to side. A little step tap. In through the nose, out through the mouth. So if you've been watching my workout, level one workouts for a while, I uh, encourage you to go give the level twos a try. They are a step up, they are a challenge, but I believe in you, you can do it. Just take it at your own pace and do what you can. Modify, I've taught you a lot of modifications, you can always modify. All right, let's slow this down. Three deep breaths together, feet nice and wide, big inhale and exhale. Two more. Last one. And then I'm gonna show you the cool down move I almost always include. Um, a lot of people complain about low back uh, soreness, pain after rebounding. Number one, make sure your core is engaged. Number two, this is a great move to relieve some of that tension in your low back. Just have a seat on the very edge of your trampoline, roll back, kind of scoot a little bit down so that you can lay back on your trampoline. Now, if it is difficult for you to get um, your hands to your knees or your shins, you can grasp behind your thighs is fine. Just bringing these knees up. You can even take a belt or a strap for some assistance and hold your knees, drawing them towards your chest Three deep breaths, focusing on your low back. Big inhale. Relax the muscles of your face. One more time. All right. Thank you so, so much for 5K subscribers. See you next time.